You said that when you sparred Connor, you hit him in the body, and every time you hit him in the body, he whimpered. What did those whimpers sound like? It, was it sound like a eh? Or was it like a uh? Or was it, was it with an Irish brogue? Like, can, can you give me a description of the sound? Did it sound like, like what did I mean, it sound like? Did he sound like he was being a, like a violated? He, he whimpers to the body, you know. Uh, I think, especially if he's getting fatigued a little bit, you hit him to the body, he's going to whimper. You know, and I'm not the only guy that said that. I think one of his other opponents had said that as well. I think Nate Diaz had mentioned that as well. Um, you know, I, I think body shots are not a common theme in mixed martial arts. So, ah. you know, I, you know uh, there's, a, there's a debilitation to them. Um, there's a slow debilitation that, to them, you know. And I think, you know, these are just things that he's learning in training camp. You know, he's coming along. I'm not going to lie to you. He, he keeps coming along a little bit in the time that I saw him there. I think he'd be a decent prospect, but I think you know you gotta you make these kind of jumps in your career according to you know the wins you get, and uh, you know you don't just jump into these kind of things. But of course, you know it's the kind of situation where he's been so successful at mixed martial arts that you know there's a curiosity to see if he can bring this kind of success over to boxing, and so this this it's been this. Uh, this, this big curiosity has generated this amount of hype and whatnot. And, you know, a lot of people think he can do it, you know. Now, you know, Paulie, let, let me ask you a question. To him, Mike, but, I mean, I know it, it's – at the end of the day, you know, you're going in as another dog, of course. We, you know, we, 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 got, we got 30 seconds. What is your prediction? Are you allowed – what are you allowed to say? What do you think – how do you think quickly do you think this fight's going to, like, really pan out on August 26th? Listen, your favorite Floyd Mayweather, I think it's, he's a logical favorite. Um, Connor's younger. He's got that youthful energy, and he's got a little bit of awkwardness. Can he make that work for him? I don't know. You know, uh, I think at the end of the day, Mayweather is a is legit favorite for a reason. I mean, uh, you don't need to ask me why Mayweather's uh, the favorite. I think even the odds makers know why. That's why they've made him such a heavy favorite and whatnot. But Connor has a legion of fans. Are they rooting with their heart more so than their mind? I mean, we'll find out the 26th. You know, uh, but there's definitely a lot of people that think Connor McGregor can do this. Uh, well, on the I, on the 26th, you know, I'll get into more the more tactical stuff on the broadcast as opposed to, you know, what might work and what might not work and whatnot and why it will work or why it won't work. And, uh, of course, I'll, I'll, I'll leave that decision up to the fans at home once I give that tactical breakdown. You said that when you sparred Connor, you hit him in the body, and every time you hit him in the body, he whimpered. What did those whimpers sound like? It, was it sound like a eh? Or was it like a uh? Or was it, was it with an Irish brogue? Like, can, can you give me a description of the sound? Did it sound like, I mean, like, what did I mean, it sound like? Did he sound like he, he was he being, a, like, a he, violated? He, he, he whimpers to the body, you know. Uh, I think, well, especially if he's getting fatigued a little bit, you hit him to the body, he's going to whimper, you know. And I'm not the only guy that said that. I think one of his other opponents had said that as well. I think Nate Diaz had mentioned that as well. Um, you know, I, I think body shots are not a common theme in mixed martial arts. So, ah. you know. I, you know uh, there's a there's a debilitation to them. Um, there's a slow debilitation that, to them, you know. And I think, you know, these are just things that he's learning in training camp. You know, he's coming along. I'm not going to lie to you. He, he keeps coming along a little bit in the time that I saw him there. I think he'd be a decent prospect.